you are going to forget about ChatGPT once you start using AutoGPT. But what is AutoGPT and how do you use it? That's what we're going to talk about in today's video. Before we jump into it, make sure you like and share this video so more people can see this. All right, AutoGPT means autonomous GPT. And in simple words, here's the difference. When you use tools like ChatGPT, it tells you what to do, but then you have to do those things. You have to perform those tasks yourself. But when you use AutoGPT, not only it tells you what to do, it also executes those tasks for you. So imagine how powerful it can be. And here's one of the AutoGPT tools you can use, agentgpt.rework.ai. You may wanna pause this video, grab that URL. I'll also put that below in the description or the comments. But let me give you a quick demo. Uh, once you go to that URL, you can create an account. I'm already signed into my account, but this is what the uh, interface is. Really, really simple. So let's give this agent a name. So I'm gonna call it Twitter GPT and then give it a goal. So I'm gonna say, write a Twitter thread about five AI tools. So I'm giving it what I my, my final goal, my eventual goal. That's the only prompt I'm gonna give this. And I don't have to give it any more prompt. So, and then I click on deploy agent and you'll see the magic in a second. So the first thing it's gonna do is, it's gonna create some, based on the goal, it's gonna create some task and assign itself those tasks. So here's the task, uh, it created three tasks. So number one is a research, gather information about the top five AI tools, yes. Number two is write a comprehensive Twitter thread, yes, that's what I want. And then number three is use natural language processing techniques uh, to create, to finalize the Twitter thread. So those are the tasks it identified. But then if you look on the, this side right here, now after identifying the tasks, it's thinking and executing those tasks. So if I scroll down, you'll notice here's the task it added for itself. Here's the second task. Here's the third task it added. And then if you scroll down, here's the, the execution on the first task. So if you step back, it's accessing Google or web or internet and getting all of that data for you. And if you, this is, I picked this really simple use case or simple thing, but you can use this to write code, write books. Uh, a lot of people use the AutoGPT to build apps and the, the thing, the AutoGPT does everything for them. The agent does everything for them. So here's the execution on the uh, task number one. If five tools it found, TensorFlow, IBM Watson, here are all the tools, and if I scroll down, you'll notice that it completed the task number one, and now it assigned itself task number two, and it's working on that task, right? And then it added, uh, here you go, here's the execution of the task number two. There you go. <laughs> this, is, this just gives me goosebumps in so many ways we can use this. And here is the task number three, the final, Twitter thread that you can actually use it and post on Twitter. There you go. So it's also adding some other additional tasks. So we've used Grammarly, an AI power writing assistant that checked the grammar and spelling. So not only it creating the content, it's also editing or proofreading the content for you. <laughs> Next, we have Hootsuite, a social media management platform. It's gonna schedule with Hootsuite. And then here is another task. Here's another task. <laughs> there you go. So I'm gonna. So it's gonna go on for for a while before it gives you the final answer. But uh, you can once it's done, you can copy everything from here and then copy uh, paste it into Word document or another file, which I already did. I'm gonna show you the final result. So here's something I did earlier. Write a Twitter thread about five AI tools, and you'll notice the here's the task that it assigned itself, and then. Here's the execution of the tasks. And if you scroll, if I scroll all the way down, you'll notice the final result is, my goal was the Twitter thread, right? Here is the Twitter thread ready for me with hashtags, with everything to be copy pasted into, I can manually post it into uh, Twitter and be done with it. Or the execution run I had this time, it's actually even thinking about using Hootsuite or social media scheduling tool. How powerful would that be? I didn't have to do anything. That's the power of AutoGPT or autonomous GPT. So think about different things that you do and you're probably using ChatGPT already, but now you can also use GPT, 
three different agents and get that agent to do the task, perform the execution for you all as well. If you have any questions, let me know. Before you go, like and share this video so more people can see this. And now I'll see you in this next video. Bye for now.